So the sidewalk system that's uh, manufactured in the uh, US, it's access control without any wiring. There's four components to the system. You've got your keys, electronic keys, smart keys. You've got your cylinders that you retrofit into existing hardware. You've got your communicators, which communicate to the software, and your fourth item is software. You enroll cylinders into your system, you then issue keys like you would do with swipe cards, and then you give users privileges. So they might be able to access a padlock on the front gate, and an office, and all the other assets within the organisation. The actual cylinders retain 1,100 audit trails, and the keys retain 3,300 audit entries. To, you manage the system by expiring with the keys, so you might issue to a maintenance contractor for two days. After that two days, you cannot get into the asset because the keys expired. When you update your key, the actual audit trail is downloaded into the system, into the software, and then new privileges are overwritten. Right. If you lose a key, you update the software and you tell the locks that the key is not within the system anymore, so you don't need to re-key. The, uh, and is that the main advantage, main of, advantage the of the system? The main advantage is that you've got audit capabilities, yeah. access control on remote assets and assets that you might not have been able to have access control on, and there's no need to rekey because you can delete a lost key off the system. And how, do, how does that padlock go in the weather? Yeah, they're fairly robust in weather, however, the cylinders can retrofit into numerous other padlocks. Right. Um, Master, Master Series, Arvis, um, and a few other uh, other padlocks. So, so uh, they are double sealed the cylinders. Yeah. The PW cylinders, and the same as the door cylinders, they've got double seals on. And retrofitting that into uh, an existing lock's easy. It is. It's just a matter of uh, taking the old the old cylinder out and retrofitting the new one in. Excellent. So the software, the software is uh, easy to use and it's just a matter of if I want to change my access to that cam lock, I don't want Brian to have that anymore, I can just go down to it and put no access and the next time I update my key it won't allow me to go into that lock. I can also have CyberPoint. CyberPoint's like a guard tour so you can have yep. Someone at the facility late at night, if they're doing a guard tour, you can have it that the key just touches the lock and there's an audit trail of the guard just tour. Just to say they were there. That's exactly right. That's excellent. The, um, to get information in regards to uh, where the person's been, it's just a matter of clicking onto the person, going to the audit report, and then having a look at where that person's been. So, filing cabinet, um, the source is downloaded from the key, Yep. If I had actually gone and got real-time information from that lock by downloading it from the lock, it would say source lock. So you can actually get information from the lock as well. But that's your order. In case there. someone's taken a key and hasn't come back, you can go and see who's been through the lock. Exactly right. Excellent. Well, thanks for that overview, Brian.